Hello and welcome to our channel. Now in this video, we will tell you how the cast of 1964 Mary Poppins has changed. I'll show you what they looked like back then in 1964 and now in 2022 how they've changed compared to when they were in this movie. Alright, let's go! Dick Van Dyke, in the film he plays Bert, an all things dealer and best friend of Mary Poppins, who is completely used to her magic. In 1964, he was 39 years old and now he's 96 years old. They once wrote, I want to thank you for being very patient with my voice. You know, you sing on top of the note, I sing on the bottom of the note, and we had a really hard time. Julie Andrews, in the film she plays Mary Poppins, a woman full of magic and love. In 1964, she was 29 years old and now she is 87 years old. A shed, uh, he was painting some flats or some scenery of some kind, but he looked up and smiled at me, so I rolled down the window of my car and I said, Glynis Johns in the film she plays Winifred Banks, the easily distracted wife of George Banks and the mother of Jane and Michael. In 1964, she was 41 years old, and now she's 99 years old. Look after him. Oh, of course. Mary Poppins, but... Oh no, it's her day off. Ellen, I wonder if you would... No, Mum. I... And um, I... Uh... The top part was something I didn't want to wear a bra because I thought that would take away from... David Tomlinson in the movie he plays Mr. George W. Banks, owner of Mary Poppins and father of Jane and Michael. He was 47 years old in 1964 and it was with great sadness that Tomlinson passed away peacefully in his sleep on June 24, 2000 after suffering a stroke. He was 83 years old. I don't deny that I am partially responsible for allowing the children to spend their days on worthless frivolity, to the exclusion of all else. But it is high time they learn the seriousness of life. Quite right. You've always been jealous of me. I have been jealous of you for you many, many years. Well, I'm not surprised. I mean, you, you know, you would have liked to have been an actor. Rita Shaw in the movie she plays Brill, the chef of the Banks Mansion. In 1964, she was 52 years old and it was with great sadness that Shaw died in 1982 at the age of 69 from emphysema in Encino, California. The highest height, let's go fly and hide and send it soaring up. Oh, loving, and you miss my kissing, you miss me honey, when I'm away, gonna be so lonely. Hermione Baddeley in the film she plays Ellen, the maid of Banks Mansion. In 1964, she was 58 years old, and it was with great sadness that she passed away from a series of strokes on August 19, 1986, at the age of 79. We have them drag the river. There's a nice spot there by Southwark Bridge, popular with jumpers. Really, Ellen? Knew we'd have a no, row. No, no, not at all. Jeez. <laughs> You'd have to hit it with a oh, stick and kill it. Because they're really good cigars. <laughs> Elsa Lanchester in the movie she plays Katie Nana, the disgruntled nanny who has left the Banks family. In 1964, she was 62 years old, and it was with great sadness that Lanchester died in Woodland Hills, California on December 26, 1986, at the age of 84. One to speak ill of the children. When do you expect them home? I really couldn't say enough. You'd be good enough to compute my wages. Uh, if it's passing in the street or on a market or something, I just let it go. Yes. And if they called you sort of flossy floozy, you know, if we are recognized, it's nice. Karen Dotris in the film she plays Jen Banks, daughter of Mr. and Mrs. Banks and sister of Michael. In 1964, she was nine years old and now she is 66 years old. I don't understand. They're not what we advertise for at all. Perhaps it's a witch. Of course not. Witches have proofs. 
done any signings or I don't think I've ever even signed an autograph. So it's so much fun to be here and meet the fans and, and be part of my own history. I'm having a great time. Arthur Tretcher in the movie he plays Constable Jones, a policeman. In 1964, he was 70 years old and it was with great sadness that he passed away on December 14, 1975 at the age of 81. While going about my duties on the other side of the park, I noted some valuables that had gone astray. I believe they're yours, sir. Valuables? Come along now. I like it. Oh. <laughs> Arthur, your cufflinks are beautiful. Aren't they? Yes, and your tight uh, class. And, and, and you oh, pardon me, that's soup. What the... You have no huh? jewelry on, Murph. Yeah, no. no, no, no. I don't. Matthew Garber in the film he plays Michael Banks, son of Mr. and Mrs. Banks and younger brother of Jane. In 1964, he was 8 years old and it was with great sadness that he died on June 13, 1977 from hepatitis while in India at the age of 21. Reginald Owen in the film he plays Admira Bloom, Banks' eccentric neighbor and a naval officer. In 1964, he was 77 years old, and it was with great sadness that he passed away on November 5, 1972, at the age of 85. Hey, my heart and aye, aye, sir. Cheesy levels! Give them one four! Empty those short levels! Aye, aye, sir! Thanks for watching the whole video. If you like this video, please share it, don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel to support us in producing the next videos.